so let me read the question first evaluate limit extends to pi by 2 cos x by x minus pi by 2 here let us assume this x minus pi by 2 is equal to y so that uh, this cos of uh, the x becomes pi by 2 plus y that is cos 90 plus theta using cos 90 plus theta that we can write minus sin theta and upon minus sin theta by theta so that will be as limit theta tends to 0 we get minus 1 the minus 1 will be the answer but so let us solve the problem because it may be given for 2 marks in the board examinations ok now let us solve this question limit x tends to pi by 2 so we have cos x divided by x minus pi by 2 so now let us say this x minus pi by 2 equals to y now what is the x value so pi by 2 plus y in accordance with this substitution we need to change the limit also so now that means as x approaches to pi by 2 now this y approaches to pi by 2 minus pi by 2 whose value is 0 approaches to 0 now this can be rewritten as limit y approaches to 0 x is replaced by pi by 2 plus y so cos pi by 2 plus y divided by this x minus pi by 2 is y so now we have the formula cos 90 degrees plus theta whose value is equal to minus sin theta it's very very important so now this can be written limit y approaches to 0 the cos pi by 2 plus a is replaced by minus sin y minus sin y by y let us take minus common so minus times limit y tends to 0 sin y by y do you expect the value of limit y tends to 0 sin y by y yes why not it is nothing but in the form of limit theta tends to 0 sin theta by theta whose value is 1 so now as limit theta tends to 0 sin theta by theta equals to 1 so using this result this can be written so minus of 1 this is minus 1 so this is the required limit so let us proceed for another problem let me read the question first evaluate limit x tends to a tan of x minus a by x square minus a square the first so let us simplify the denominator that is x square minus, minus a square that can be written x minus a into x plus a using the algebraic identity a square minus b square is equal to a minus b into a plus b so after that let us say x minus a is equal to y so that is becomes that becomes tan y by y limit y tends to 0 absolutely 1 and 1 multiplied by for we have to apply for the limit to the uh, another function that will be the limit x tends to a 1 by x plus a so that uh, it can be evaluated so in this manner actually we need to solve this problem so first let us solve this question limit x tends to a tan of 
एक्स माइनस ए बाई एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस ए स्क्वायर वी हैव ए स्क्वायर माइनस बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू ए माइनस बी मल्टीप्लाइड बाय ए प्लस बी एम ए करेक्ट ओके यूजिंग दिस ऑलजीब्रिक आइडेंटिटी दिस एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस ए स्क्वायर कैन बी रिटर्न एज एक्स माइनस ए इंटू एक्स प्लस ए सो द नेक्स्ट स्टेप फॉलोस लिमिट एक्सटेंड्स टू ए टेन ऑफ एक्स माइनस ए बाय दिस विल बी एक्स माइनस ए इंटू एक्स प्लस ए हैव यू फॉलोड so now this can be written as the product of the two functions the one is tan of x minus a by x minus a multiplied by 1 by x plus a so let us write it as the product of the two functions now so this equals to limit x tends to a tan of x minus a by x minus a multiplied by 1 by x plus a now the limit is being applied to the both the functions so now limit x tends to a tan of x minus a divided by x minus a multiplied by limit x tends to a 1 by x plus a this is a rational function am i correct now so now in this case we need to change the limit as x approaches to a x minus a approaches to 0 am i correct now so this can be rewritten for our convenience to apply the limit limit x minus a tends to 0 tan of x minus a by x minus a now let directly we can substitute the limit here so we get 1 by a plus a okay so if you say let us assume x minus a is equal to theta as x approaches to a the theta approaches to 0 so now this can be written limit theta tends to 0 tan theta by theta multiplied by 1 by a plus a is 2a it's a constant 1 by 2a this can be written 1 by 2a times this is one of the standard formula in limits already we have discussed in previous cases so as theta tends to limit theta tends to zero tan theta by theta is also one it's a important formula so this equals to 1 by 2a this is the required limit